Hello, this is Blakey Rad. I'm going to play a game called uh, Select Input Device. Oh, uh, no, it's actually called Camera Obscura. Uh, I'm going to use a controller, which I highly recommend that everyone who plays games use a game controller. I know it sounds crazy, but uh, it's usually the better option if, if the game at all um, supports it. Camera Obscura. Okay, so the, the Steam page for this game uh, specifically compares it to Fez and says that this is the most innovative platform game since Fez, which is quite a claim, but whatever. Um, it has surprisingly pixelated text, and for some reason it uh, seems to be in a 4.3 aspect ratio and letterboxed. But what? Well, letterboxed. Letterboxed. I can speak. Um, yeah, okay. Oh look, level select. Um, okay, let's play the approach. Uh, okay, so I am this white-haired girl, I guess. Um, music's kind of pleasing. <laughs> the the letterbox opened up, but the screen's still letterboxed. Uh, press A to jump. Hold A to jump higher. Do they mean double jump? No, they just mean literally. The longer you push the button, the higher you jump. Okay, I got that. Okay, here we go. The tower. That's all it was. The tower. A civilization's greatest triumph. It's the most colossal failure on eternal tombstone. No one with any sense set foot near the tower, let alone ventured inside. There's one of 71 of those. Okay. So that's 171st of the story, I guess. Um, I am not going to argue that. I'm not going to say that we're going to get to all 71 of those. Hope oh, there's no falling damage. Oh, look. It's, um... Yeah, it's that. Uh-huh. Oh shit. Wait, how do I uh oh. hang on, I gotta I gotta get this photo. Oh no. Okay, I don't know how to get that photo. I'm gonna skip it for now. So you're not even gonna get all the story. I'm not even gonna try. I've already failed. I've already failed at the story. Okay, anyway. So uh the mechanic of this game, which we haven't seen yet, is Supposedly you can take a picture of a piece of the land. Hopefully it'll teach me this soon. You can take a picture of a piece of the landscape and then move your picture and then stand on it as if it was like the picture was the actual thing. In fact, like I already need to do it, but I'm not sure. Okay, so. Um, I'm not sure how it works exactly. kind of did it, but now... Oh, okay. Okay. So why? I guess. Kind of just spazzing out. I thought it was the right trigger on the controller, but apparently it, it's not. Okay, so you can kind of see the premise here. I can make the picture. Whoops. Hmm. I don't see the premise here either. Hang on, I, I've already, like... Okay, press triggers or B to create an after image of your survivor. Oh, solid enough to walk on. Oops. The problem is you seem to have, like, it seems to take forever for that ability to reload. Oh, shit. Oh, I see what happens. As soon as you jump, it goes away. Okay, hang on. I think I can get... I think I get the idea here. What? No. I don't. It doesn't follow me. I mean, I get what I'm supposed to be doing. The after image just only moves a little bit. Oh, it'll follow you until your camera is recharged, and you can replace it by creating another after image. Well, that's not really what I was seeing, but okay. But how do I make an after image that goes up? That's what I don't understand. Oh, wait, the first jump? Hmm. I don't get it. I don't really get the mechanic here. I'm really stupid. I've kind of accidentally been doing it. There's a drained aqueduct. The background looks like a whole bunch of, like, um... I don't know what it looks like, but it doesn't look 
like a structure that was actually built. It looks like it just kind of collapsed. Okay. You can look around. I don't know how that helps me. What? Okay. Apparently dark surfaces you cannot be stood on. Oh, damn it. I need a faster camera because I F, I F up the camera and then... Ah, if you F up the camera... You, uh... Ah! You have to wait forever for it to recharge. Very irritating. Whoops. Hang on, I gotta try that again. Come on, fade out image. Oh, come on! How? I don't... Uh, this is actually, uh... Not as good as Fez. I'm sorry, but... The creators of this game brought the comparison on themselves. So I, I take no, uh... No, four? Number four? How many of these did I miss? Uh, I take no, um... Responsibility for, uh... For that. Okay, I'm in the ventilation shaft. This is what a ventilation shaft... Whoops. This is what a ventilation shaft looks like, guys. Uh, I'm sure you were wondering. Oh, oh, that's not good. I gotta try that again. There we go. Okay. Um... I guess it's kind of a clever mechanic. The creators of the tower were ingenious as they were reckless. It was a miracle the tower stood at all after so many centuries and yada yada yada. Okay. Wait, how do I... Oh, hmm. Okay, um, fade out image. I gotta figure this out. Oh, there we go. There, look at that. I solved that puzzle. Okay, I'm very good at um, the Camera Obscura game. I forgot the name of the game. I usually do that. I'm very bad at remembering the name of the games I'm playing. Camera Obscura. Okay, it looks like the exit's directly above me. I don't suppose it would be possible to just do this. Oh, you can shortcut it. Why didn't you tell me that the first time, you stupid game? Okay, well, I'm gonna stop. Stop fiddling and trying to get up there prematurely. It's, it's probably not possible, or if it is, it's like a score challenge thing. Okay, here we go. She realized coming to the tower was probably a mistake, not for the danger of her life, which she had blithely faced so many times, but for the danger to her heart, which she had faced only once before when you asked her to choose. Oh god, this is gonna be like one of those, um,. One of those braid things where it turns out there's like an evil stalker and there's a story behind it but no one gives a shit. Isn't it? Okay, dried well, tower base entrance. Um I think you guys pretty much get the idea of the game by now. Uh I guess I'll get to the end of the level and then kinda call it good. Many people would probably be afraid of going down the balcony of the one, but she wasn't. Okay, so there was a guy. She had some dude that she's hooking up with, and he promised her some shit, and then who cares? Okay. Oh, oh, oh! Oh, that still worked out. Okay, good. I wish I had a magical camera. Hmm. That doesn't work. How do I do this? Oh, I can just do it this way. No, that doesn't really work either, does it? Well, I've gotten one level up, so... Oh, wait. Huh. Huh. Ah! Ah! Well, I think I have the right idea here. 
Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay, I think I have it here. Why was she coming here anyway? What was she hoping to gain? She knew this place was a tomb, home only to the dead. Oops. Damn it. Okay, there we go. Um. Hmm. Wait, I've already... I've already completed the first thing. Okay, well, this is a good stopping point. Okay, well, anyway, that is, um, Camera Obscura. Uh, I hope it introduces more gameplay mechanics later on. It's kind of... Yeah, it's okay. Two. Yeah, I missed number two and three. Well, I know I missed one of them because I saw it, and then... Yeah, I missed four, too. Okay, well, whatever. Um, yeah. Uh, Camera Obscura... I guess it's okay, I don't know, I'm not really that into it, but it doesn't seem bad in any way, except for its strange insistence on running in uh, 4.3 aspect ratio, which is something you don't often see in 2015 anyway, the end.